Now to the football frenzy. We're bringing you highlights tonight up to 24 games. Including a big one at Fifth Third Ballpark, and that's where 24 Hour News 8's Jason Scherz. This is live. Hey guys, yeah, you know, we're so used to covering games, of course, at the high school football stadiums all across the uh, area, and we're used to covering baseball games here at Fifth Third Ballpark with the White Cats, but here, yes, we've got football at the baseball ballpark. Joined now by Jane Voss, the Grand Rapids Press, for the big Rockford Muskegon game tonight. So I think they've had seven high school games here over the last three years, including a couple of college games but never a game quite to this magnitude of a Rockford and Muskegon. This is the first time I've seen one, Jason, so I don't know what's going to happen. I just think it's going to be really strange to watch a football game on this baseball diamond. We, we've had other games here, and, and from all indications, you know, the feedback from a lot of people is, is it's gone over well. I know some people in the Rockford camp weren't overly thrilled with giving up a home game at, uh, at the TED to come here and play a big rival such as Muskegon, but it should be interesting. Well, the game itself is going to be interesting. It's going to be classic power versus speed. I mean, Rockford's going to win the wishbone. Um, Muskegon's be their veer option, and they're gonna. It's gonna be a classic game, I think. Do you think the field gives an advantage or a disadvantage to either team? I think it gives both of them a disadvantage. It feels weird out here. You know, you're on the 20 yard line, and you're on second base. I don't know. I, I don't quite get it. Yeah, you're run, running across that infield dirt for the touchdown. So obviously, we'll see how how uh, things shape out tonight. Of course, uh, Rockford Muskegon here at the ballpark, just one of up to 24 games coming your way tonight on the football frenzy, guys.